So, so as you know, The Sims is all about the relationship management, kind of playing with life. Sure. You, you know, kind of toy with life and see what happens, you know, what it gives back. Um, the thing that we added to, uh, to this um, specifically for Windows uh, 7 Mobile is the, um, the achievements and the leaderboards that tie to your overall um, game performance. So just starting a new game, uh, you start out with the Create a Sim feature. Um, it has a ton of, uh, a ton of different uh, options in here. Um, we can go, we can start out with a guy or a girl, Start out with a girl. Um, you can change hairdos or makeup. So how, how similar is this experience I've been played on, on an iPhone? Yeah. Is it basically the same exact thing, or is it a little it's, different? Um, it's pretty similar uh, between the two, um, except for the achievements and the uh, and the leaderboards. Um, but for the most part, it's it's fairly similar. Um, this one we are doing the uh, 800 by 480 uh, resolution, so. It'll look uh, a, little, a little bit different, but for the most part, it's fine. So you can change different outfits. I'm just going for random crazy looks here. I already gave her a crown. Uh, but there's a number of different possibilities. We'll just go with that. You can change shoes. Um, all the way, I mean, you can do everything all the way to eye color, which eye color wouldn't really matter because she was wearing sunglasses. Then there's the dice down at the bottom, which just does a random generation of different outfits, uh, different combinations. So then once you hit start, you can go and choose your persona, whether you want your sim to be a, a jerk, a jack of all trades, a nice guy, a sleaze, uh, a maniac. Um, so this one, he's just crazy. Then you choose a couple other traits. Um, he's got no sense of humor. He's easily bored. He's vain. Let's see, vain. Yet he's friendly. And he's a bit of a slob. And you go in and name your sim. We'll just name him something quickly to move along. So we just unlocked an achievement already. Um, it's the right step achievement. So it's it's kind of one of the early achievements we give just for uh, for kind of going yeah for doing your customization, taking some time to really put something into your sim. Then it immediately drops you into your house. There's normally a tutorial that it would walk through, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip that. Um, you've got your basic needs at the bottom: uh, food, sleep, bathroom, and shower. Um, so you want to make sure that your sim is, is you know, well fed, well rested, has a shower when he needs to, that type of thing. I have a new, new wish in there, uh, but my sim is just having a snack. Anywhere you tap to, that's kind of where he goes. It's a, it's the main thing is it's this uh, open world environment. So I'm gonna go to the town and just see if I can interact with some other Sims or whatever. Very addicting. Yeah. Uh, thanks for showing us. Oh, you bet, man. So.